Oke, okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Sajban Sajadi. I'm from State University of Surabaya. I will present my science project video. Seven segment is a digital numeral display. We have found a lot of seven segments in digital clocks, red lights, thermometers, and others. Its working principle is to convert a 4-bit input into an output that can represent a decimal number. For example, if the input is 0010, which is the number 2 in decimal, then the segment that lights up are the segments A, B, D, E, and G. If the input is 0100, which is the number 4 in decimal, then the segment that lights up are the segment B, C, F, and G. This time, I will show how to implement Boolean algebra on 7 segments. According to Wikipedia, Boolean algebra is the branch of algebra in which the values of the variables are the truth values true and false, usually denoted by the numbers 1 and 0 respectively. It also uses two binary operations, namely plus and times, and a unary operation, namely complement. In logic circuits, the gate that represents the plus operation is the OR gate, like this. The gate that represents the times operation is the AND gate, like this. The gate that represents the complement operation is the NOT gate, like this. Suppose we have a Boolean function f in x and y is equal to x y complement plus x complement y plus x complement then we can represent it in a logic circuit like this we can also simplify the function by using the properties of boolean algebra that i saw on the screen Then, the result of its representation in a logic circuit will also be simpler like this. Okay, let's discuss its application to the seven segments. First, let's state the numbers 1 to 9 in a 4-bit binary number form like this. Pay attention to the segment that must be lit on the seventh segment. Then we get the truth table like this. Okay, because we have the truth table, then we will look for the Boolean function of each output. Here, in simplifying Boolean functions, we will use the Carnot map. Before making simplification with the Carnot map, we must first know what mean term, max term, is OP and POSR. Mean term is the result of product or the given logical n that is display once. A function that use mean terms that are sum or given logical or are called is OP. Max term is the result of the of sum or given logical or that is displayed once a function that use max terms that are multiplied or given logical n are called pos okay let's go to the implementation